this is a kid who's getting bar mitzvahed and he doesn't know how to read Hebrew, so he just mumbles the Terminator theme. <laughs> Today is my judgment day. Uh, yeah, so I was uh, having dinner with my parents uh, last week for Jew holiday, and uh, they invited some cousins over, and uh, my mom starts choking in the middle of the meal, and, you know, a normal person would get up and do something about it, but I go, I go to my cousins, don't worry about it, if we could hear her cough, she's not choking. That means her windpipe is still open. And my dad, without missing a beat, goes, yeah, the kid's right. So my mom's just coughing there. My cousins are horrified. Like, we're not doing it. My mom's just banging on the table. My mom, well, my mom, like, thinks she's going to die. She doesn't know what to do. She starts, you know, making the signal. She looks at my dad. My dad just goes, what do you want me to do? My mom just starts punching my dad in the arm as if that will motivate him. So my dad just gets up and stands next to her, just idly waiting for her to stop choking. Cubs are horrified that we treat each other this way. Finally, my mom stops coughing and just goes, who wants cake? <laughs> yeah, I got a, I got a big family. There's, uh, there's me, my mom, my dad, my brother, sister one, sister two, sister one's fiance, sister two's husband, and Sister 2 also has two kids. If one more person joins my family, we could field a soccer team. It's just getting absurdly huge. Uh, I, I like love my sister's kids. Like, it's awesome being an uncle. Uh, like, when I babysit them, it, it's like hanging out with two little stoners. All they want to do is, like, eat macaroni and cheese and take naps and discuss what rainbows might taste like. like it's wonderful. Uh, my niece... My niece goes up to me, she goes, Uncle Aaron, Uncle Aaron. And I go, yeah? Do you know I'm a princess? And I'm like, I play along. I play along. I'm like, uh, oh yeah, princess of what? And she looks at me like I'm an idiot. Princess of Candyland. And what, what else would I be princess of? Like, do you think I like rounded up my cronies from pre-K and we like overthrew the government of Grenada? Like, no, I'm four years old. My favorite colors are purple and shiny. Fucking like Candyland, man. Yeah, I was, uh, I was on the subway and I saw a like teenage girl and a middle-aged gay man, and I knew he was gay because his hair looked exactly like his fur coat. And I've never seen, I've never seen a happier pair. They were sitting on the train, and they were, they were reading Us Weekly, and this is the conversation that went down, and I'm not gonna tell you who said what, but this is the conversation. Oh my God, she got so fat. Oh my God, you are such a bitch. I know. <laughs> That's the conversation I had. Uh, can I confide in you guys? Can I tell you a secret? I am, su my, my biggest fear is raccoons. I'm super afraid of raccoons. I know, it's ridiculous. Uh, my, my house growing up was by the woods, and I would sleep with my window open, and I'd hear the raccoons like, like go through the garbage at night. And my biggest fear, they, they, they've, they've got like tiny little hands. My biggest fear is that a raccoon is gonna find a gun in the woods, <laughs> grab it, come and shoot me. And it could happen, because he got those tiny little hands. Celebrity lookalikes, that's a thing, right? That's a thing, right guys? Uh, I got the worst celebrity lookalikes. Uh, the best one is young Alfred Molina. That's the best one I've ever. Uh, yeah, I was at a party once and a girl just goes up to me, she goes, oh my god, you know who you look like? Whackness. <laughs> you look like the whackness. She did not know the character's name. She did not know the actor. She started calling me whackness all night. Everywhere I went, she would just go, whackness! Whackness! Oh, ooh, white wine. Ooh, whackness! Uh, I was walking around and a homeless guy once said, Yo, man, you know what you look like? Fat Fred Savage. <laughs> like, okay. okay. Uh, if 
by far the worst celebrity lookalike I've been told was uh, Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> but less butch. But less butch. Yeah. Uh, my best friend works uh, retail, and he had to work uh, Black Friday. I think the only job worse than that is probably working cleanup crew at an orgy, right? right? Yeah. I was, uh, I was on a date, at least I thought it was a date, and out of nowhere the girl goes, I just want to be friends! And I said, okay. So uh, I farted, quoted Anchorman, and then gave her a titty twister. And then I said, there, we're friends. All right, I'm Aaron Glazer. Thank you very much. <laughs>